Okay, so today I'm on Hillary trying to show you how to do a cool glitch to make it so you, when you use the hologram it's not really you, it's something, it's somebody else. And another thing is how to make an infection mask. So I can just do both of this and same thing. So let's get started. I am using a different camera to record this, so it's great comment if you think I should use my other camera or this one. Make sure this to load up. Okay, so I at first I would go for infection spawns and stuff. So infection spawns, human are red. Okay? So when you are doing this, see how it says red team? You don't wanna, okay, so you, then you go down to advanced after you change this to red team to spawn. Then you go advanced, game specific. Okay? This right here. Okay, the game specific. The third one down, change that to true. Okay? And then go down to game type label, change that to infection spawn. Okay? And then you're pretty much done with the this is this will be the human spawn. And blue is exactly the same, except the blue ones are infection spawns for the zombies. So, same thing, change that, and do it, and change the INF underscore spawn for a game type label in the game specific true. Okay? And then the that neutral, that's, you, they're useless, so you can just not have them in your level. And then for respawns, so you have your respawn. You have for zombie respawns, it will be, well, you don't have to do anything with this. You don't have to get, change the game specific or the game type label. All you have to do is just change the, the team and say I want this to be human. You change it to red team. Okay? So you have your red team. And say you want this one to be a blue team for zombies. Change this to blue team. And then you're done. Okay? Then you have your two spawns, human and zombie. And then another thing you will need are in um, objectives, hill marker. See, you're going to want to have at least four to ten, four to eight hill markers in your level. Okay, so you just go to what team you want. I'm going to say red team for human. And then you will, um, for this, you go to advanced, game specific true. Game type label, infection, INF underscore haven, not spawn haven. Okay? And then that's red team. And then for this, you can just, for zombies, if you want to have another spawn for zombies. Game specific true, label, INF underscore haven. And then red team or blue team. This one's going to be a blue team. So, that's pretty much it. And then. One more thing, kill boundaries. Kill boundaries are so they, the people don't go too far off the map, okay? So, um, not really sure where they are. Okay, um, yeah, kill boundaries. Soft kill boundaries is a 10 second one if you go off too far of the map, like this. And that, uh, kill boundary is where you just walk through it, and then you're dead. Okay, so they can come in handy. I would recommend using the soft kill boundary to make it really long so they can't run right through it and go on the other side of it. And that's pretty much it for your infection map. Now here's a glitch with um, the hologram. Hologram glitch. Okay, so I'm just going to get a hologram. I have my hologram. You can't do this in any games. Or if you're lucky, you can... When you die, you can do this, but... Just um, stare at the ground, that's useful. And then hit the keypad to go on forge and to use your hologram. Use that at the same time. Well, I didn't do that right. So if you do that on the same time, it should spawn a different person. Alright, so I'm failing at this right now. Sorry about this, but. It will work. Just I don't have good timing. <laughs> you have to time it exactly at the same time or it will not work. 
sometimes if you do it on a certain surface it won't work, so I'm going to try it here. Oh. Sorry about this, but it does work. Trust me. So you can try this keypad and the uh, hologram. Same time. That was not the same time though. Another way, just keep hitting both of them. Okay, so right now it's not working for me. I don't know why. Let me just try something. Okay, I'm just going to try it on the wall. Wait for my thing to come back. Okay, I'm not getting it right now. I don't know why, but it does work. Don't know. Okay, um, well, that's a fail on this level. I mean, on this video, but whatever. Um, it does work. So, I'm just going to go try it in a different place on the map. Sorry if this is laggy. Is that the suicide? And watch where I spawn. I'm probably going to spawn on the red team. Hopefully not the blue team. Okay, so, um, yeah. That's pretty much it for this. So you don't have to watch it till the end, but if you would like to, then. And there's just one more thing, actually, with the glitch. This one does work. Okay, so you have your armor lock. You get your armor lock, go down your armor lock, and then forge. Okay? Then you grab another armor lock, go to delete all of these, press V on it, delete all of these, and then you delete all of them. And then you have armor lock, if you don't, you can't really tell, but I will get on a vehicle and it will show that I am, it thinks I still am in armor lock. See my guy, he's in armor lock, but he's not really in armor lock, it's just a cool glitch, easy to do, so, yes, so. This is my fourth video. If you like it, rate, comment, subscribe. And that is all for this YouTube video.